right, coming up next, we get to this flyweight matchup between Wilson Hicks and Ben Tanwin. And now our tail of the tape for this flyweight tilt. Pace is four years the elder. The rest is roughly identical. So Dan Mergliata shares the cage. You ready? You ready? Fight now the southpaw stance. Oh, hit kick blocked though by Hayes. Just out of the range with that right hand. Oh, beautiful head movement. Slips there. Opens with the left hand and lands flush. Straight left. Ooh, blocks the shot. And he landed the right hand there. Oh, a huge block there. Nice body kick there. Now he goes for the single leg. Taken down now by Hayes. Now he's going for an arm bar here. He's got the arm here. Now he's gonna throw his leg over. Turns the hips. He's gonna sit back. Throw the leg over the face. Break the grip. Stunning. And that's Stunning. Do it. And he really made it look easy. Great job in getting this fight to the ground quickly and getting an early submission. Well, yeah, Joe, that was fun while it lasted. He told us he wanted to be at his most efficient here tonight. He certainly didn't waste a lot of time. He knew he wanted to get the fight to the ground. He gets the early takedown, and the submission follows shortly thereafter. And one more time from this angle, we can see that arm bar locked in tight for the tap. And let's watch it here one more time. Deep submission and the tap. So a seminal moment for him here tonight, Joe Rogan, as he gets the win by way of submission. Certainly one of the bigger wins of his career and as big a statement as he could have made here tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliotta is going to stop this contest at 1 minute 30 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by tap out due to an armbar, Wilson! Well, the celebration is on in the corner after the big submission win here tonight. He told us during fight week that he needed to prioritize a finish here. Decisions were not going to be enough to take his career where he wants to take it and expeditiously. So, gets the submission tonight. Now the celebration is on. There got to be few things in all of pro sports as satisfying than to be able to celebrate a UFC win with your coaches and training partners. And thankfully for this young man, now that is all that is left to do.